Hey kids! Today we'll be learning about the stars. Are you ready? Let's begin. What is a star? Stars are giant spears of super hot gas. Stars get really hot by burning hydrogen into helium. This process is called nuclear fusion. This is what makes them so hot and bright. Now let's continue with the life cycle of a star. The first stage is birth. The beginning of the life cycle of a star starts at its birth stage. Stars begin as giant clouds of dust called nebula. As more dust bundle up, gravity becomes more stronger and it starts to get very hot and becomes a protostar. Once the center gets hot enough, a process called nuclear fusion will begin and a young star is born. The next stage is main sequence star. The newborn star will continue to burn energy and glow. This process will continue for billions of years. The star will stay at this state for the majority of its life, which is why it is called the main sequence. The star will remain this way until it runs out of hydrogen. The next stage is red giant. When the hydrogen runs out, the outside of the star expands and it becomes a red giant. And finally, the last stage is collapse. Eventually, the core of the star will start to make iron. This will cause the star to collapse. The average star will become a white dwarf star. Larger stars will create a huge nuclear explosion called a supernova. After the supernova, it may become a black hole or a neutron star. There are many different types of stars. Stars that are in their main sequence are categorized by their color. The smallest stars are red and don't give off much of a glow. Medium-sized stars are yellow, like the sun. The largest stars are blue and are hugely bright. The larger the main sequence star, the hotter and brighter they are. Dwarfs Smaller stars are called dwarf stars. Red and yellow stars are generally called dwarfs. A brown dwarf is one that never quite got large enough for nuclear fusion to occur. A white dwarf is the remnants of the collapse of a red giant star. So let's head over to giants. Giant stars may be main sequence stars like a blue giant or stars that are expanding like red giants. Some supergiant stars are as big as the entire solar system. Neutrons. A neutron star is created from the collapse of a giant star. It's very tiny, but very dense. Here are fun facts about stars. Our sun is a star and is around 4.5 billion years old. Most of the stars in the universe are red dwarfs. Stars twinkle because of the movement in the Earth's atmosphere. Many stars come in pairs called binary stars. There are some groupings with up to four stars. The smaller they are, the longer they live. Giant stars are bright but tend to burn out fast. The nearest star to Earth is Proxima Centauri. It is 4.2 light years away, meaning you would have to travel at the speed of light for 4.2 years to get there. And that is all for today's video about stars. I do hope you enjoyed today's video. See you soon. Bye-bye. If you enjoyed the video and want to see more videos from us, please click the subscribe button. Also, give us a like. That will help us. We thank you so much and we do hope that you enjoy our videos. See you soon!